New tonight, the mother of the 13 year old boy who was shot and killed this weekend is speaking with First Coast News. She wants answers to who killed her son. On your sides, Brianna Ray Turner is joining us live in the newsroom tonight. Brianna, you spoke with Prince Holland's mother and how did she describe her young son? As I was speaking with his mother, Chantel Brown, I could see the pain in her eyes when she described Prince to me. She says he was the life of their home. He would cook for the family just about every night and would cut their grass, their neighbor's grass every day. She says her son had an old soul at heart and would do anything for his family and others. Brown says it was last Friday when she first heard he was going to be playing football. Holland's stepfather, Christopher Polite, says last Saturday he talked with Holland before he headed to practice. This was the last time the family saw him, and that night they got a knock at their door from a football player's mother telling them that Holland was shot. Now the family says they immediately drove over to the scene only to find out that their son was shot and killed and two others were injured. He can't never walk back in here. I can't take him to school. I can't pick him up from school and I can't take him to practice. I can't go to his games. My baby wanted to be a wide receiver on the Chiefs for the Kansas City Chiefs and I can't see that. The family is having a vigil for Prince tonight near where the shooting happened on Saturday and we will be there it starts at 730. I'm here live in the newsroom. Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side.